What's happening you guys, it's Extreme Power Sonic and today we're playing um, Firefall. It's been a really long time since I played this game. Last time I played it was, I think it was, okay let's see, this is March, November. And so, because, like, in this game, the last time, there wasn't anything much to do. It was just, you know, thumping, thumping, getting resources and that's pretty much it. And I think I stopped once I got my tier 2 um, assault, which is, you know, this fire cat if you can't tell. Which is also nothing, they've added some new um, battle frames, but what they've done is you don't have to tear them up anymore. Now you just have to buy them if you have enough pilot tokens or red beans instead, like use real money to buy them. And they're based of two types of each um, battle frames, like there's two types of assault, two types of dreadnoughts, two types of biomech, two types of engineer, you, well, you get my point. So for the, for the, assault, the assault, which is the one I'm you know, most of, is like... Fire cards and tiger club. For the fire cards, it's pretty much high offense, causing um, you know, damage over time. You know, using fire, just fire damage, pretty much. That's what the fire cards is all about. While um, freaking, what's it? The tiger claw is most about mobility and speed. I think the, out of the whole two new um. What battle frames that they put in? I think besides the fire card, besides the fire card, um, what else? The dragonfly looks badass, and I don't remember. I don't remember the other frame that's also a biomech frame tier two, but I'll, they've done that for themselves as well. So now I'm pretty much doing one of the new missions, which is an Aris mission, which I've told about. I still can't remember what it's called, but the Aris comes from. I know it's R called Re. I don't know, so I just check. Got another one. They've also improved the AI of most of the chosen as well, like, you know, now they can build their own weapons, react, and, like, they, they act more in coordinations, like, in, you know, in groups, like. It's not just being in random places attacking them from different locations. So, enough talking, let's just get to the decision. That's awesome. I think the only thing I don't like in um, this fire cast, which is the one thing only, is the alternative fire. I just don't like the way it's only just three shots. One, two, three. I know it does um, damage over time, like, you know, little damage over time, but you know, still. I still, I still like the whole, you know, going to mini pieces and like that. And I'm just talking to dances at this point. This is an example of an open mission. This guy, he's not on my team, I just, you know, seen him doing his own thing, so, so I'm just gonna join him. What is this? Plant? Okay, he's not having Shit, I just stood there. Okay, is he dead? Can you help me? Come on, dude, help me. I can place mine. Duh. Damn, it's not gonna help me. Uh, I can, I'm gonna have to skip this because I'm way too far away from that area. Am I not skipping this? And I'm back. Well, that was kind of a bit stupid of me just standing there. I should have you know, backed up or something like that, but I don't know. Like I was saying before, they put in some new features, like new ultimate moves, which is pretty good. I've only used Firecats one yet, and Firecats one is pretty awesome. I'm it's like, you have to, um, see, do you see the bars at the bottom of the abilities? If they're yellow, it means that it's charging up. If it's red, it's going down, because you're not doing anything, you know, you're not taking damage, you're not doing damage, so it's going down. If it's green like it is now, I can use it. I think I showed it an example of it in the video, but I'm just going to do it again, because it's awesome. It does so much damage, so... It's like a big explosion. I think they made the enemies a lot more tougher. Okay. Gotta plant the bomb, yep. Now, this time I'm not gonna sit there and. Oh, there he is. You can't revive me, bro. Is there one more left? What, was, what do we have to do now? 
But this I've never been to this place before now that I think about it. It looks awesome. I really can't wait till this game starts kicking in with the story mode. That's the only thing I'm waiting for. Um I think that's it really. I think this whole Aris um you know mission system is to give you stuff to do while you're out in the open world like but I'm just waiting for the whole you know open world PvP. Oh wait, that brings me to the point like now now like um this changed the frames like for the PvP and PvE. That like, the frame I'm using now is no I can upgrade them, I can customize them the way I want, I can add afterburner on all, all that good stuff. But then in the PvP, you give it an arch type battlefront that you have to use. It's, I think it kind of balances out because when I play them PvP before this update, everyone was so overpowered, you couldn't do much, it, like, unless you're really super girl, because you know, I wasn't playing too heavily on the PvP, I was mostly focusing on the PvE like, part of the game. So, um. I think that's good. I might, I might, I might try that out in, in another video, maybe. But now I'm trying to understand what this other mission is all about. Oh, there's another waypoint. I'm gonna skip this because maybe to, just for the fact, fact that um, you guys just don't want to see me travel up there, so I'm just gonna skip this part. And I'm back, and now I'm in the new part, no, second part of the mission. Which is pretty much inside there, and there's, oh, there's already someone inside, so I'm just gonna join him. Damn! I need to start upgrading the, you know, system. In case you're wondering how you can upgrade your battle frame if you're not in the beta, or if you are, but you're still not sure how you do that. They pretty much divided the whole, you know, upgrade system into three types of things, which is Mass, CPU, and I can't remember the third one, but that one is like you know, it's it it like it upgrades how much damage you can do. Shit, I see where you come from. Where the fuck did you come from? So yeah, and you can upgrade them using um your XP points, which is kind of the same, but they made it more simpler for people to like upgrade. Now what exactly am I supposed to do in this mission? Am I supposed? To I'm gonna put those two in my group actually, cause you know, they might actually have an idea what to do. No, I don't wanna die. Do you wanna die? Shit! I've heard some complaints of people saying that the Tiger Claw one, no, splash damage, or splash area has been reduced completely to the point that there's barely any splash at all. Oh shit. I mean, assaults are all about giving splash damages and, you know, Fire cut seems to be doing enough splash in my opinion. What is that? Am I supposed to defend that? <laughs> Let me just put them in my team. If I can anyway. I don't think that Oh look at that oh look at that ability. That's pretty new, isn't it? Oh no, I never used the dreadnought. Shit. Why don't you look for the putting people in your team? Okay there it is. Open, open army, what's that? Oh, this is the clan system, isn't it? Yes, yeah, the clan system, okay. A fighter squad. Where's the other guy? Okay, yeah, he joined my squad. Dude, you wanna join my squad? No problem, bro. I'll put you in my squad. We go do sports stuff. <laughs> Did he join? No, he didn't join. What are we supposed to do? We're supposed to defend him. Oh, defend him from what? Yo, this is more work. A clan could use your help up near Thump Dump. Head to the old cargo way station. They got an Irana problem. Would you believe I once worked there? Third worst job I've ever had. It was that part of the mission. Oh, it is. Yeah, it changed now. Now we can go to the next one. I'll skip this one. No. No, it's actually only 200 meters away. I, I think you guys can handle it. So now I have a recon and a de dreadnought. I'm just gonna call them heavy defense because you know I can't dreadnought. Sounds so weird. 
Oh, there's a medic. I need to put a medic in my team. Medic! Get your ass over here. Join my team. We need you to heal our asses when we are in the battle. We need to get a crate out of there before they poison all these little crates. Did I get him? No, I can't. Stand still so I can put you in my squad. Alright, you've been invited. Oh no, have I put... Yes, now I have a medic in my team. How many people can I put in my squad? I forgot. I think I can have... I can only have four... Five... I don't know. I have enough. I have enough. I have enough. Just find the crate and else, take it an assault, the dreadnought, medic, and recon. That's fine. I'll do the damage. He'll, you know, gives us buffs for the... What, what the hell is that? We can't just nine up in the distance and medic heals us. That's a good team actually, I think. No, oh she is Yeah, okay. What's this? I wonder if I can just jump down. I can't wait to see the chosen storm. Because when I read the you know, patch notes, it says that the chosen have been fully, you know, like upgraded. Like now they can, I think I said this before already. You know, coordinate, work in teams, like strategize. Like you have to actually, and they've added more. Are we supposed to defend this or put this? Nicely done. I was just reading up on this bug bomb they're gonna use. Tell you what, we need to find ourselves some of that. Okay, we're supposed to defend this now. Why are we defending you, actually? I have no idea. What is that? Oh, it's a burst of health. That's cool. Oh, look at those mammoths. Should I dare shoot? Oh, wait, I already did. Shit, why did I do that? They're not coming over here. That's weird. In the last, um, before, in the last patch, they used to be really aggressive. Oh shit, yeah, okay. Shit! Shit, okay. I don't wanna die, just have to... Damn it, my team is just leaving, like me, oh no, they're not bound. It's still there. Okay, um... That's a long distance. I feel sorry for you that you have to carry that. What do you do? Give me health. So the pretty much, you know, besides the basic um, battle frames, they pretty much upgraded every other frame, you know, tier two. I don't think. Oh, when, why do I keep saying tier two? There is no tier anymore. It's like for the beginners. You get the basic warframes. And then once you have experience, once you've earned XP points or bulb tokens, then you can choose whichever whichever one suits your um, playstyle pretty much. I think they simplified it to make it easier for people. That's what I think. And I think this mission kind this mission thing glitched there because this is where we are last time. Complete dynamic events. Out in the field. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Oh, oh that's a challenge. Turret deployed. We're just standing here. Okay, I'm just gonna, you know, I'm gonna skip it till I actually figure out what I have to do. And if I can't, I'll tell you. Okay, I'm back and I think I found, I think I understand what this Aris mission actually is. It's just, you know, open world missions with different locations where you can do little missions. So I'm, I just found this little pit hole that I'm just going to go into. It. And while I was, you know, when I had to skip this, I ran out of ammunition there. I was quite a lot of um, mammoths again. And um, two of my squad members kind of this shot after, you know, not be able to find out what the mission is or something like that. This it's like game, um, once you finish an Iris mission, you just look in the map, find another Iris mission, and just, just do that. That's pretty much it. It's just something to do while they're still working on this game. It's how you can pick up resources to, you know, customize your battle frame to, you know, make it more unique, more to your playstyle. Hey there, pal. I'm a 
radio operator. Tinkerer, hobbyist, and then some. You can call me Dick Allen. Say, you think you can do me a favor? I'm looking for transmission signals from survivors out in the Melbourne. I need you to grab a portable antenna from the terminal. At least I still have the medic though with me. Use it to track down signals for I think the correct term is Biomech. So I'm disgusted. So I call him Biomech. But I'm so used to calling him Medic for some reason. Yo, it's downstairs. Okay, you've seen it. Whoa, this this is getting more more and more better each time. Take a what's this? I am not pick I have to pick it up. Am I done with the mission? What is this? Okay, I can't go here then. Oh, we're supposed to shoot? Oh, no. oh, yeah, we have to go outside now. There's an egg, there's an egg that popped up. Okay, uh. So, yeah, these arrows missions are pretty cool. I like them. I think there's something to do besides constantly dumping up. And with the whole addition to, you know, melting, tornadoes, chosen. Attacks and stuff like that. I think I might be playing this game for. Just gonna use my special ability. So, boy. Just gonna go outside actually. Use the medic will be fine. Sure. It's the game where I go there, all over the place. <coughs> Wait, stop, stop, don't move. Your battle frame can process the transmission at that location, but you'll need an antenna to find the next one. Oh, this is stupid. So, I thought that was actually part of the mission. What are you start doing? Dude, let's go. Alright, now we just have to put this in the... I think we're done actually. One second ago. What now? Doctor! Okay, that's it. I pretty much that's it though. What? The thing is, I feel like there's something missing. There's no like. You know. There's no like congratulations for completing the mission. It's just like. It's like. I don't know. I'm gonna go look for another one. You can't get another signal unless you use an antenna. Come and get one of my new antenna. Struck one at a manufacturing station. Okay, let's, I'm gonna do one more um Aris mission and then I'm just gonna call it a day. Because apparently this mission is a kind of lame. And I'm back and I found some chosen. And some zombies as well. I think I called Tormented Souls or something. Shit. Sure. No, they're purple. Oh.
that guy could have revived me, but no, he just left me for dead. I have to skip this again to get there quickly. Back again for one, two. Hopefully, he hasn't finished it off yet. Oh, he hasn't. Okay, cool. Well, that does it for this mission, I think. Oh, there's another one. He didn't revive me, so why should I revive him? Uh, I think that's it for this mission. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thumbs up if you like it. Leave me in the comment section below what, what other things you guys want to see. Uh, you know, just write down what you guys want to see, and I just upload it, talk about it, and stuff like that. I'll just stream by sign, sign out. Peace.